found this in the recycling bin. It's got a, it's like a thermos drinking looking thing and uh, it's got some powder coating over it that's flaking off. Today I'm gonna try and mechanically remove all the powder coating with uh, my handy dandy drill and this little wire brush scraper. Let's see, Let's see how it works out. Just to clarify guys, uh, this thermos was found in my own recycling bin uh, and it was tossed out by my roommate. It's kind of unwieldy. Now as far as the selection of the wire brush, uh, if you notice this is a brass wire brush. So it's softer than the stainless steel that I'm, I'm scratching on. So it won't create any scuff marks and but it does do a very good job of removing the powder coating which is essentially plastic uh, that's melted onto the steel um, now this was kind of it was more difficult because in retrospect I should have mounted onto something um, static instead of using trying to manhandle it with both hands one hand with the drill and one hand with the uh, the thermos bottle. So most of it is gone. Uh, what I'm probably going to do is burn off the rest with the torch. Now the majority of the, uh, the powder coating has been taken off mechanically by the uh, brass wire brush. Uh, I'm going to put a torch to it. I think there's a vacuum chamber between the outer outer uh, cover and the inner inner chamber. So uh, what I'm going to do is just to err on the side of caution, I'm going to fill this up with water so that way um, the temperature gradient doesn't warp the steel. And here you see I'm using a standard propane torch uh, and I'm taking care not to sit in one location too long. This, the whole point of this is to burn off the, the small fragment that's, uh, that survived the manual scraping and burn off the excess. Now as you can see from the prior video there wasn't too much of it so this, this is the extent of the uh, burning. So there, removed most of the powder coating. Uh, one thing I'm not certain of is the fact that, you know, we expose it to pretty high temperatures and I'm not sure if the uh, stainless steel, you know, if we change the uh, molecular composition, so now maybe prone to rusting. Anyway, uh, I hope this helps you if you're trying to remove some paint, powder coating off of a uh, household material. Good luck. Thank you.